Uh, can you believe we're 100 days away from the 2014 Winter Olympics in Sochi? So much okay. going on. So much going on. <laughs> Segways everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> um, we have... We have one of our um, uh, medal hopefuls here tonight. Mm. So please give a warm TFC welcome to Slope Style Skier and X Games champion, Anna Seagull. Anna Seagull. Hello. 100 days out from the Games. Yep, yep. Uh, it's 28 degrees outside. <laughs> there's, I'm loving it. There's not even much snow in my freezer. Uh, how, are you, how are you training and preparing for this event? Oh, uh, you know, I take the warm weather when I can get it and it's actually really nice to be um, in Australia for a few months training. Um, up on the northern beaches in Narraveen and we've got quite a few of the um, Winter Olympic team up there training. A few of the half-pipe snowboarders and border cross riders and mogul skiers and doing a whole lot, a lot of gym work um, and then trying to mix it up with some road riding, some surfing, some beach beach interval stuff. But, yeah, it's it's fun in terms of training. Yeah. <laughs> and it's full on. But, um, you know, you know, this is Thursday FC. We are a football program. But can you mm -hmm. tell us a little bit about, Anna, what you and the guys get up to when you're on the road and you need to pass some time? What are you playing? OK, yeah, so we do a lot of travelling around Europe and around North America and there's a lot of time driving and time on the road and... The boys that I travel with always seem to um, carry a soccer ball with them. Oi! <laughs> um, play this game. I don't know if it's the same in Australia, but it's called Muff. And it sounds a bit... Has anyone heard right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Have you heard of this? <laughs> uh, tell, us a bit, tell us about it, Anna. Elaborate. So, so Muff, everyone that's playing the game, we all lo load out of the car or the van and we all stand in a big circle and kind of like kick around the ball to each other and you're not allowed to drop the ball and you're not allowed to hit it or obviously touch it with anywhere below your shoulders. And if you do drop the ball or touch it with your arms, you get the letter M, then you get the letter U and then F, F. <laughs> <laughs> and I tried to Google what it looked like, what it stood what for. It looked like, what it looked like? <laughs> oh, OK. <laughs> <laughs> oh, foot and mouth. Um, yeah. So, yeah, I tried to Google what it stood for, couldn't find it, and I don't know if it's an American thing, but um, so the loser has to get up. We find a big concrete wall or something like that, and the loser and the first person that gets the word muff first has to um, stand up against the wall and bend over like All this. Right. <laughs> <laughs> And then we get to kick a ball at him. So, yeah, there you go, even better. So football and skiing wouldn't, you know, you wouldn't think that they go together. But we found a video that proves that it actually does. I mean... That's pretty cool. <laughs> what is that? Are you doing, yeah. are you doing that in training? Oh! oh, 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 oh. That'd oh. probably be me. Yeah, yeah. Do you reckon this could be a new event? Oh! oh. Yeah, look, I don't know what's worse, this or muff. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your question. <laughs> I think it did. Now, you've also had your fair share of blunders on the ski slopes as well. Guys, let's have a look at this and what Anna also gets up to. <laughs> this is her coming down. You think she's making an epic landing and she's gone right into the bushes there. What I was most concerned about this footage was that no one came running to help you. <laughs> no. They just were happy to let you stay stuck in the bushes there. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> Hey. Yeah, the boys just stood on, stood beside and laughed. <laughs> uh, Anna, thank you so much for coming on. Obviously, all the best. Obviously, you're you're a fantastic uh, skier representing Australia. Best of luck. Hopefully, you get uh, bring home some gold. Maybe even end up in Rio Ooh. afterwards as a uh, as a little prize to yourself. Hey, still to come. Or oh, give it up for Anna Seagull, by the way. Yeah.